Welcome viewers, in 2016, the GOP bought its soul to a ways right, virulent racist, self-delusional sociopath to symbolize the birthday celebration in the 2016 election. And thanks to surgical help from Vlad the Imp, Trump pulled off the miracle, beginning an avalanche of anti-Trump sentiment. The bloom was once off of the rose early. But before we continue if you are new to my channel, please take a minute of your time to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button for any updates from us. The day after inauguration, the biggest world protest in records confirmed up to throw shit all over Trump. But the GOP let Trump emerge as the using pressure in the 2018 midterms, now not fertile floor for the GOP anyway, and the Democrats flipped 40 seats and took over the House. The first cracks in the wall commenced to show up in 2020. Trump was once as soon as once more on the ballot, and he did his first class to fill the relaxation of the roster with trustworthy Trommies. But there was once frigging in the rigging. Trump had a teat lock on the small donor GOP base, and massive cash donors and companies had been protecting again on funding Trump-stimulated candidates. The GOP and the RNC had a money crunch that might also have priced them countless shut races. The Democrats held the House, flipped the Senate, and Biden grew to be president. Now we're in 2022, and the story receives even worse for the GOP. This election must be a cakewalk for the GOP, however Biden is resurrected, the Democrats have exceeded some of his agenda, and Roe v. Wade modified everything. But as Snake Plissken said, the greater matters change, the greater they continue to be the same. Trump has his personal slate of unelectable candidates jogging nationwide, and even worse his hammerlock on the GOP small donor base is even better. If you're in the GOP, and your closing title isn't Trump, you're flat stony broke. And it's going to fee them. Whether the GOP or he takes both the House or the Senate is immaterial. Trump is going to run once more in 2024. And his stranglehold on the GOP small donor base will solely get stronger. The trouble is that deep pocket donors aren't going to return Trump or anybody related with him, and Trader Tot doesn't share his spoils. It's pure and simple. Today's GOP has an extreme money waft problem, and it's named Donald John Trump. Trump will run once more in 2024 and drag his very own slate of candidates with him. And as soon as again, he'll manage nearly all of the GOP cash. What right does it do the GOP to select Trump in 2024, if they quit up with the Democratic House and Senate especially, if the Democrats pull the upset in November and preserve manage of the legislature, this is going to pressure an existential debate inside the GOP. By their calculations, they can't win besides Trump's base, however what precise does electing Trump do if they have no different control? particularly if his greed chokes off money and charges them nation seats and governorships? One way or the other, after November, the GOP is going to have to do some serious self-reflection. Because Trump is solely fascinated in taking it all. What is your take on this video? Please kindly drop your comments below and thanks for watching.